Yes, you read that right. Samsung Galaxy S3 battery mod. Basically what happened here, I ordered one of these from Hong Kong. And uh, for whatever reason, this company, RC Mark, decided to ship the battery separately for whatever reason. And yeah, it's still not here. A week later. So I got the radio with no freaking battery. Well, if you know these fly sky batter or these radios, it's pretty hard. You can't really use them without their battery as they're so small. Profile and their included battery is rechargeable lithium ion battery. So you're kind of hooped, right? What do you do? Well, sorry about that. I went through and did a little, little mod of my own here. And yeah, it works great. So basically I have a Samsung Galaxy S3 and I'd purchased this little guy. It's a charger, but also a battery. So I was looking at it, hmm, 3.7 volts. It's basically a one cell lithium ion, but a very high milliamp rating, milliamp hour. It's got 2,500 milliamps, whereas the included one has 800. So anyway, I'll show you the goodies here basically what I did if you look up in the corner which side is it here this side down here you can see those four tabs well those hit onto the battery like so so there you have it basically I had to take a Dremel to the inside of this they've basically made it so it's very hard to fit any other battery but their own in there they've done this so you have to buy their $20 battery well these batteries cost three dollars by the way and uh, also you can leave them in the fly sky and plug it into the wall with the USB charger and it will charge them through the transmitter as well. So I just thought I would share this with you guys. It's a pretty simple method uh, to have some extra batteries for these things fairly cheap. So if you liked the video, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And thanks again for watching.